So if we have the screen closed, it will save a bit of battery life as well, right? Who knows? Well, here we are. In where are we, Cap? In Tesco's. Where? Tesco's, all the way Tesco. over there. Tesco. Tesco. Um, so we're here, we're just doing a bit of shopping, right? Yes. Uh, we don't know what we're getting. Well, we might have decided on. We have on, an idea. We have an idea. Possibly what we want to buy. Yeah, I think we're going to go for either hot, hot or stew of some sort. Yeah. Um, hopefully this uh, wind isn't too terrible. Um, it's awful. It's awful today. It's totally awful. So that's our plan. Um, we'll get back to you with what we've got. I guess we'll do like a trolley overall view, or if we're having one of those up hand baskets. My trolley. It's in my trolley challenge. Yeah. It's not really a challenge. It's like. It is a challenge. The big challenge is challenge. So the challenge. challenge is to cook the food. Challenge. That's a challenge. Yes, that's a challenge. I'll get back to you shortly. There's the enemy, Timson. Who? <laughs> uh, so we'll get. Whoa. Get back to you shortly, I guess. Yeah. Uh, so what we got here today? So here we are after our long day, mm -hmm. being down at um, being out on the road, I guess. Yeah. It's we were in way, many probably. places. We're in many places, as we covered already. Uh, we might not have been able to capture in um, Tesco what we were after. I may have got a s small little snippet. Uh, There's probably not going to be it's anywhere. Kind of. This is what we got, <laughs> and that was it because you started running it through the till, so. We'll go over now. Well, the woman on the till was a little... Ditzy. Yeah, a little weird. She was a little weird, so we thought we wouldn't uh, capture any of that because it's no. it felt weird. Anyway, so we'll go over what we've got here. We have uh, freshly prepared, straight not from the straight from the butchers, not out of a plastic <laughs> package, um, chicken thighs here, yeah. as we can see. Slightly squished from the packaging. That's not a problem. Yeah, we also have... Butternut squash and sweet potato uh, pieces. We have casserole vegetable mix. Put on a couple of body brands. Other brands are available. Sponsor of Tesco. <laughs> and then uh, broccoli florets. So that's probably we're going to probably steam these separately. We're going to chuck this and this and, and these into, into our big pressure cooker we've got here. With, with some rainbow pepper. pepper, salt, maybe a bit of paprika. And maybe some oh, other things. Oh, maybe some garlic. Oh, yes, some garlic. We've got over here somewhere. Garlic in our little garlic tub. For some reason, it's in this little like kitchen odds and sods drawer. We might need to get some more garlic on the order as well. Yeah. Um, so we'll just chuck that down there for now. Have we got an onion somewhere? We've got some onion in there, haven't we? So we don't need any onion. more onion. We might, we might want to get another onion out as well, maybe. So we're basically going to start. I'm going to go all this stuff. Let me prep my camera up here. So we can see everything a little easier. A little tilted. I want to be able to see us all doing this, right? Ladybugs everywhere, apparently. Yes. So as we can see, we've got a nice filleting knife for some reason. Because we're going to do, be doing a lot of filleting, even though we've bought freshly filleted um, chicken. No, so I don't think we need this. We've got a nice non-filleting knife, really. A knife is a knife for me. Well, not a filleting knife because you can't chop straight with a filleting knife. What you after? So we've got other chopping boards up here. We need them. So you do, you're doing them here. I'll do yeah. these. I'll do these. I'll do these. So, we'll chop it up all our veg here. That's peeling our onion over there. Why well, cry? <laughs> cry over spilt onion. Cry over spilt onion. Nobody cries over spilt onion. Ow! Are you getting what you go, go on your nail? Ugh. Yeah, it went right in underneath the nail. Mmm, that's why I don't have my nails cut. Rip your nail off while you're making all your food. I'm sorry, I'll just fall into the pot and someone will have it. Mmm, that's a little crunch. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> delicious. Delicious crunchiness. Itchy nose. Do you know itchy? I've got your favourite with my elbow. <laughs> oh, it's all wet. I don't believe it. I don't know what you're talking about. It's not wet. 
Totally moist. Totally moist. Pressure on the end of the nose. Means you're healthy, like a dog. I think. Is that what it means? If a dog's why. nose is wet, it's healthy. Good. If a human's nose is wet, it's not healthy. But my name isn't dog. No, it's cat. My name's cat, not dog. I think you're going to say it for the cat. Maybe. Are we putting this on boil, are we? Or are we yeah. checking everything in first? Check it on for boil. Why not? Check it boil, it. boil it! Boil it! Boil it good and proper. Have we got all ready? Have we got any uh, broth mix? No. No, broth mix. No, broth mix available. No! So, we've got uh, excellent chopping here by Catherine, as we can see. Very expert. Yeah, it'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Pig? Yeah, like babe, pig in the city. I'm not saying you're a pig. I'm just saying the saying. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Oh, that'll do, donkey. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. There you oh go. Oh my god, you the don't Shrek have version. noise sayings. The Shrek version. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Uh, my chicken needs in as well, huh? Yeah. Chicken straight in. Okay. So in here we've got some... Baby carrots. Baba. Baby carrots. Some baby no carrots in this mix. I've also got some not carrots, potatoes. Baby, baby, baby potatoes. Oh my god! Can't We've got get some carrots ba baby carrots. On. We've got some red onion pieces. I'm not going to show you every individual piece in the bag. I'm just going to show you every time. <laughs> yeah, but they're all there. They're all there. We've got um some leek. Yeah, no, you've got a leak. <laughs> I've got a leak in the in the, in the pan. Uh, it looks like sweet, baby. What is on the packet? Uh, it doesn't Take say. Turn it round. It is carrot, sweet, sweet potato, leek, and onion. And onion. So I think we've gone through everything in this particular pack. We've got some more red onion. I think we've gone through everything. Yes. Yeah. The onions going in. The onions going in. We've got that pack of veggie going in. We usually wouldn't buy pre-cut stuff, but in this instance, we thought. Why not? Seems easier, right? And in this one, we've got butternut squash and sweet potato, so... Big old piece of butternut squash. Some of these might need chopping now, actually. Well, if it's going in for the, uh, slow cooker. Yeah. Pepper. And pepper and schnaut. And pepper and schnaut. We'll have a look at the, uh, the broth ratio. I just want to make sure some of these pieces are... A little more edible. I'm sure it would be edible. Well, you need spoons now. You don't need to like, have a knife and fork in a bottle, which is awkward, right? Now, who leaves spoons out on the filming counter? My goodness, who does that? Sorry, we're a bit new to filming in the kitchen. I'm sure we'll get better one of these days. Yeah, well, it's only what, second episode? Second, like first episode of filming in the kitchen. Yes, second episode in general. First episode of kitchen filming. So we'll, we'll get a better rig at some point. We're doing a little stand maybe. Slightly wider camera angle would be nice. We'll be working on that one of these days. Clearing up all this junk. You're drunk. Put me junk in the trunk. So we've got some smoked paprika here, if we can see. Oh, start this way, smoked paprika. I think I might put a little teaspoon of that in. Just a little. Yeah, a Just a little, a little teaspoon to taste. Is too it's much. People out there that are going, are you doing this completely wrong? I don't think it matters because it's how you're not eating it, are you? You're not eating it, are you? It's edible. It'll definitely be edible. So Catherine over here is prepping all the uh, vegetables. The um, Broccoli, as they call it. Broccoli! That wasn't a fist manoeuvre. Bro fist! <laughs> fist! Fist in your face! We're getting all the, bro, all the bros on the channel. You have to come up with a name for us. Yeah, for the... That was done. I'll show you trick it back over there. Um. <laughs> The we're, the we're the Looney Dunes, but we need a name for yourselves out there, all those four subscribers we currently have. 
maybe five by the time this goes out. Well, you never know. You never know. Anything's possible. Anything is possible. Uh, so as we can see, professional chef cat over here doing her work. I won't say professional. More than professional. That's what it is. You're more than professional. As long as it's edible and it's lovely. As long as it's edible matters. by a professional, it doesn't matter. Do you want me to prep this chicken? I guess we're just chopping it in half, right, maybe? Mm, yeah. We I don't, mean, we don't want to keep it whole. I'll probably take a while for them to cook, so just... Well, not the smaller, but you want them... You want them bite size, right? You don't want them... You don't want like big just thighs. No. If you can help it. Here They've we've got, got a nice set thigh. of... Nice set of shears. They call them kitchen shears. Ching, ching, ching! Ching! ching. You can hear them. That's how you know you've got a good set of shears. So here we have. She is at ears. She is, those ears. You can hear them. You've got a good set of ears. You can hear them, you've got a good set of ears. Or oh, the camera's got a really good microphone. That onion that's making my eyes go a bit. Ah! You're crying. You don't want to cry, babes. No. Get rid of all this. No. You don't need all this fat, do we? Get rid of all the fat. Yeah, nobody likes fat. Get rid of all the fat on the chicken. There's not a lot on these because they've been pre. Uh, Pre filleted, but. Three so by butchers. Wait, wait. <laughs> yep, no, we, we we filleted and skinned them, obviously, and then put them into this plastic tray. Obviously. <laughs> obviously. Uh, we're the professional butchers here. There's some gristle in this one. Oh, good job. Good job whoever did that at the butchers. Get rid of this. A little bit of bone there, chop that off. Always have to go over these things anyway. Not any of this fat. Oh, you can't get all of it off, but. I think you set the try. I think you try and get a lot of it off. I put all these in six right? pieces. Yeah, that's alright, yeah. I think you're going to cut them in half or do whatever. Just long slips, long. Long nip slips, yep. <laughs> you got it. You don't want to have to have like a knife and fork to eat them, right? So, just something you could easily put on a spoon, not have it fly off, right? So I say it. Try I think. Pretty good going. That'll be fine. Because once they cook, they'll go down, won't they? They'll go down a little bit, yeah. They might swell up. Take up the old pan. No! Put a bit of bone on this one as well. You always wow. have to go over these. Tesco's what are you doing? Honestly, you're not doing a good job with uh, checking. Chicken. Chicken. Chicken the chicken. Chick does the. Uh, Chicken now have a cane with a, a G. A G. Chicken. Chicken. I want some chicken. It's chicken from the king. Probably can't see a lot here, but we're basically uh, chopping off all this fat stuff here. Probably just move down a bit. Move that other tray out of the way. Tray? Look at the cutting, cutting tray out there. Because we've got a chuck away bin here. This is our. This is our um we just you know get rid of all these Try fatty it. bits. So out there is a finger your finger! No my finger's chopped off! Oh, so we'll just get rid of like these white bits here, as you can see. Shing! Shitting! And the chicken fat bits, we don't particularly want those. I mean they have a bit of flavour I guess, but we don't want too much. You don't want excess. I mean, you know, the stuff on the surface, right? Like this sort of stuff here. But in this instance we'll be there. Uh, can't get it all off, but we'll keep a bit of it on there, right? That's around with a little bit of fat. No. It'll probably melt away at some point. Yeah. It's turning to just add to the you do. add to the steaminess. Let's break up. And then I'll just get rid of that bit there. It's a bit stringy bit. Yeah, see how this one's got a fair bit of fat on it. It's fairly easy to get off. You know, stuff that's easy. You need a good 
good set of knives or a good set of snippers. Good set of snippers or on knives, whichever. Snip, snip. I'm just check for any of our bits, I haven't checked out yet. Oh, see, look at this one. Premium fat on this one. There's a lot of fat. Get rid of that one. So that's what we do. We get rid of all this stuff that we don't need or want. Well, we might want it, but it's not. Really good. <laughs> Dancing, dancing cat in the kitchen there. With a knife. With a knife. Dance for us, cat dance. Da -da -da -da. Stab, stab, stab. Da -da -da -da. Slice, slice, slice. Da -da -da -da. Well, I'll be stab, 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 and slice, slice, slice. Yeah, yeah. That satisfies your need, and then you get chickeny bits on your hands. Like, look at all these red bits. Eugh. I don't like. Eugh. I don't like handling raw meat. That's my main issue with raw meat. I hate handling. Handling raw meat. Raw meat. No, but it's, that's not the issue. The issue is it, it feels slimy and gooey, and I don't like that feeling. I said you should tongue in your mouth, but you don't wonder about that, do you? Yeah. I can't go slippery and slimy in my mouth. Well, how often do you touch your tongue? All the time, at the inside of your mouth. All the time. You don't notice it, right? No, but it's raw meat that does it to me. Yeah, I get it. That's quite, uh, quite a global thing, that. That's why you have like chefs, right? They do it all for you. Yeah, because you get like pre sliced. Pre sliced and pre chicken. Chunky chicken. Okay, not. Mm. Chicken, 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 chicken. Looks like our pot is going to the boil right now. Shortly, I'm just uh, cleaning up these tools around so we get chicken all over the kitchen. Go wash your hands, Mrs. Yeah, sure. Oh, do you just want to sweep this off of here for now? It's away. Go you wash your hands. Scrub the bits off. I'll just wash my hands. Perfect. Just cleaning up around there. Okay. We've got we've got some dishwasher clean, don't worry. We've got, we got some, some. Don't worry. Oh marvelous. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Let's put it away. Yep. Play it off. I did that out. No. No. Stay in. Go on then. It's pretty nice. I took it. Oh. Very nice. Yeah. Perfect for winter. Yeah. Winter nice and long. Penguins. Nice and long. Yep, that's right. Now we're just giving our uh, stew a bit of a stir here, separating all those bits of chicken. Can't cut up. And we'll show you into the eye of the beholder, into the eye of the monster. You can see here, we've got this nice light on so we can see. We've got some nice stew going. That one had like a little bit of a uh, and green herbs of some sort maybe. I don't know if we've got any anywhere. Just to add a little bit of colour to the mix. Well, there's green in there. Yeah, there's green in there. Just be like little bitty bits of green, right? Well, I guess we'll have some uh, We've got some broccoli. We'll have That's some broccoli green. going in, yeah. Maybe not in here. Pop the lid on. Yeah, we're popping the lid on. And we're going to let that uh, go up to pressure. Oh, you have to uh, get your glasses on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've got to be very careful about this because for some reason somebody Missets it and this trigger it off. You gotta have that same or roll up. 
You can't see that in that one. That has to be set forward before it will close. We almost had an explosion. Bam! A big explosion because somebody misset the pressure washer. Pressure cooker. Pressure washer. Pressure washer. Pressure washer. Spraying them out everywhere. Spray it around. Spray, 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 spray it around. Spray it around. So as you can see, we've got our broccoli ready to go in. Well, it's not going into that, but it's. I guess we could do near the end, but I mean, there's quite a lot of broccoli there. That'll be for like three, three days, that. I think it all has to go in. Unless you can pop away. Unless you want to pop it all in and freeze the rest of the stew. We'll probably have to put more water in that stew for doing that. No, because don't forget it. Um, the water will drip in. The water will drip in, yeah. You know, from the steam. Oh yeah, the water will drip in from the steam, you're right. You don't want to put too much water in, otherwise it'll be just watery mess. It's probably boil it off, I guess. But yeah, you don't want to put too much water in. When you do the stew or a casserole, not too much water. I say a good rule of thumb is drown it in water and then remove all the water. That's what they say, isn't it? If you say so, I mean tomato. So. <laughs> I say so, tomato. Tomato, tomato. tomato, tomato. Good, 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 good coffee. Coffee. Everyone loves good coffee. So while that's all cooking up, we're gonna go on pause, I guess, for now. Um And we'll be back. We'll be back shortly, I imagine. Yeah, I would say give that maybe half an hour. Food 40 will minutes. probably be prepared in the click of a finger. <laughs> so here we are back at the kitchen. Yep. We're just starting our last bit of food. seasoning in. Look at this food, oh my goshness, look at that! A little juicer. Go with our, getting this on a bit higher just to bleed off some of this water. We're just going to stir that in. I'm getting a nice spoon. Spoon! And we've got the uh, broccoli on the go, look all steamy, ready to go. Creamy. And we'll get that too. Well, the sweet potatoes, they kind of like, well, the chicken's fallen too, so it's, it's fine. perfect. 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 Perfect consistency. You just need to boil off some of that water, really. I guess adding this uh, gravy is yeah. going to help. Gravy is going to help a little. It's going to thicken it up a little bit. Yeah. And there's a tad more there. We've got expert chef Catherine here on the uh, on the stirring and the precise addition of chicken gravy granules. I like mine thick. I like my uh, stew thick as well. Yeah. We can boil it off, we get it up to boiling temperature, it won't take long to boil all that uh, liquid off anyway. Yeah, well, I don't know, it's quite a lot of liquid. It's quite a lot of liquid, but if we give it five minutes or something. Yeah, well, if you're going to leave it any longer, all the late sweet potatoes and that going to fall. That's true. Well, we'll get back to you when it's on the plate and we're eating it. That'll be perfect. Alright, see you in a bit. And we have some beautiful food coming through. Look at the, look at the spread on this, we've got some... Potatoes, potatoes, carrots, carrots. I got these in the wrong order. Some chicken, chicken broccoli. Some sweet potato in here somewhere. I think a lot of it's broken apart, but that adds to it. There you go, it's a little bit here. Yep. It looks great. Cat's it got her own bit over there. Yep. We're just filming mine now. Let's have a little, little verdict of it. Very, very nice indeed. I got the root vegetables. Nice. I got a bit of everything on there. I'll give you a high five. Yeah, yes. <laughs> good team effort there. Yeah, mainly cats. I I was the I was the chicken chopper. She added it all in. Added the flavours. Pristine, excellent work there, cat. Yeah. Um, well, I think it was a joint effort. It, it was, was a, definitely a joint, a joint effort, effort, but but cat added all the flavours. The bit that matter. She added them all to the pan. I get I'm it. good at deciding what to eat. Cat is very good at deciding <laughs> what to eat. I'm I'm just the eater, and cat's the, the maker. The maker, the maker and the eater. So This is probably us what sign off now, isn't it? Maybe we'll have a a finisher. Yeah. Maybe later on. We're just gonna edit our current clips that we have. Yeah. And then we'll um add on. We may add on at the we end. Have left. Yeah. Uh, some final thoughts for the day and what we might be planning for future. next time, the future. Mm -hmm. 
think I don't know if we've got anything. Oh, we do have a big day planned on Wednesday. Oh you're yes, gonna love this vlog is, you're going to have to stay tuned. Definitely. The morning's going might be a bit somber, but the, the evening's definitely going to be fun. Well, no, I think yeah, the morning yes, but say from about eleven o'clock, half eleven. It's going to be. It's going to be jam packed. It's going to be jam packed full, full of all sorts goodness. of stuff. We're going to try and. I don't know if we're going to have enough battery life to film the whole lot, but we'll certainly save it for. We'll we'll try our best. Yeah. I mean, we'll have our, I'll have my phone. Yeah, if we'll, I have we'll have to phones. Use it. I'll have my phone. Cat will have her phone. Worst case scenario, we'll have. We might have to change cameras around a bit, but that that's not your concern no, anyway. No. Um, but we've got a big day planned. Uh, mm -hmm. what, what kind of teaser can we give them? Uh, well, I don't want to give too much away. Well, it could. It happens maybe during winter, and the police do it a lot. So combination of those two, and um, it's it's going to be in a city. Aha, uh, I got what you're coming off with now. I've already just clicked on. <laughs> <laughs> took Kat a while, and she knows what's happening. Yeah, so I know, but I was just trying to think, winter be, and police. Yeah, it might, it might be a little, it clicked, it clicked, might be a yeah. little cryptic for you guys out there, but still. Uh, we, it'll, be we, fun. It'll, it'll be fun. It'll definitely be fun. Mahoosive fun. It'll be mahoosive fun. Hopefully we'll be able, I, can't, I can imagine we'll be able to film what we're doing down there. Um, Maybe sneakily. Maybe sneakily. We may have to sneak like sneak little clippets. Maybe. But then it, it's YouTube music. Yeah. We, we may have to like. Oh, we may have to like put over copyright. Yeah, we might have to put. We may have. We may have to. Well, we might be giving too much away here. But enjoy us. Join us for the ride. We might leak more on our next vlog in episode three. Yeah. Well, we'll, well we, we will. We'll be leaking everything <laughs> in episode three. Yeah. So, it's yeah, gonna ha be happening on episode three, but it'll, you have to tune in to watch it because it's going to be fun. Yeah, you will have to tune in to watch it. So, cats coming around here for us just to do our final sign off if we need to. And um, so, yeah, get that get that video camera turned around. So, uh, for us for now, mm -hmm. well, may maybe a little bit later, but we might. Maybe it depends because we don't have anything planned for later. No. But you never know what happens. You never know. We could. Go for a walk. Good night walk or something. Yeah. We might we might take you along, but yeah. As for now, we're going to say signing off. And if we catch up with you again, we'll catch up with you again. Yep. So see you later. Bye. Dooners or the loonsters, oh, whatever you well, want to be called. Yeah, we have to make up a name. You have to make up your name. We're not very good for at now, that. For now, it's temporary. But yeah. Uh, so we'll see you later, guys. Bye. Bye.